Okay, this is for my grandkids. Okay, here it goes. This is... Okay, let's start off with chords for right now. Okay? See, this is an octave. From C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. Now, a C chord, the way I play it, is E, G, and C. Okay? Now we get a beat to it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now for an F, because this is the chord progression. F, C, F, and G. Now with the F, you go F, A, C. Notice I'm just <coughs> changing from this, these here to up over here. So it's one, two, three, four, F. One, two, three, four. Now for your G, you're just moving up one. See how, see what I'm doing here? From F to G. So this is G, B, and D. So it goes one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay? At least you can play something right away. So now, okay, here is the scale that is a must to learn. One, two, three, thumb underneath. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Backward. One, two, three, four, five, thumb, third finger over. See this? One more time. Thumb under. Now backward. Middle finger over. Okay. Now, this is called an octave because octave means eight. There's eight no notes in an octave from C to C. Now, um, this is it for right now. Um, practice makes perfect, so practice this and let's see what happens. Practice makes perfect and if you get good enough, we can jam. Okay, bye.